Hello, I'm Tony Mann. I'm director of the Math Centre at the University of Greenwich in South East London and I'm lucky to be the Gresham Visiting Professor of Computing Mathematics. My series of lectures for next year will have three lectures which, which explore how mathematicians turn paradox into inspiration. So these lectures will cover three topics. The first is about logical paradoxes, um, the kind of mind-bending statements that, for example, if I say this statement is false, you can't determine whether it's true or not. The second looks at an area of mathematics called game theory. Here there is a puzzling situation called the prisoner's dilemma. Basically, it says that if you have a fairly common real-life situation um, and you apply mathematical logic to it, then the outcome is much worse for you than if you just naively did what seems obvious. And the third lecture is about a very recent discovery. The physicist Juan Perondo um, was exploring an area of quantum physics and he proposed a mathematical game in which it turns out that you can have two different mathematical games, both of which you expect to lose, but if you swap randomly between them, then you expect to win that resulting game. These topics are important in themselves because the mathematics has real practical importance, but they're also important in showing how mathematics works. Mathematicians start with a situation which is paradoxical, confusing, not properly understood. People think about it often over a period of many years and it becomes clear, it leads to new mathematical ideas, it leads to better understanding and applications in areas you'd never have imagined from the initial, initial problem. I'm hoping that these lectures will entertain the Gresham College audience, which is a very sophisticated audience, that they will provide illumination and ideas for people, that perhaps after the lectures people will watch them online and that they will reach out and make more widely known some really nice mathematical ideas that perhaps aren't as well known as they deserve.